Hey friends, have you ever felt like you're on the edge of greatness? Like you're on the verge of breaking records, reaching heights you've never imagined? Well today, we're diving into the incredible story of Parker Schnabel, a young gold mining prodigy who has done just that. This isn't just about digging for gold, it's about ambition, resilience, and pushing the limits of what's possible. So, sit back and let me take you through a journey that has redefined the gold mining industry, one that Parker proudly calls a world record season. Now, picture this, it's 2018, and Parker Schnabel, the young prodigy of the Yukon, sets off on what would become a groundbreaking chapter in gold mining history. Fresh off some big wins but hungry for more, Parker was not just looking for gold. He was chasing something much bigger, legacy. This season wasn't just about ounces and dollars. It was about proving that with the right mix of leadership, strategy, and a bit of luck, you can turn the impossible into reality. But let's rewind a bit. How did Parker, a kid introduced to mining by his grandfather, become the man to break records and redefine the gold mining industry? Well, it wasn't easy. Season 9 started with the odds stacked against him. Equipment breakdowns, brutal weather, and operational setbacks all threatened to derail his dreams. The pressures were immense. Gold mining isn't for the faint of heart. It's dirty, dangerous, and demanding. But where most people might have crumbled under the pressure, Parker stood tall. He took every problem as a lesson, every setback as a stepping stone. And let me tell you folks, that's where Parker's genius really shines. It's not just his tenacity, though that's a huge part of it. It's his strategy. You see, gold mining isn't just about hard work, it's about working smart. Parker's success is rooted in his ability to think five steps ahead. He makes bold decisions, takes calculated risks, and, more importantly, knows how to lead a team through thick and thin. Now, imagine this, after all those struggles, the tide turns. The crew starts finding gold, real, tangible success. Parker and his team start pulling ounces from the earth like never before. It wasn't long before they smashed through the 7,400-ounce mark, a haul worth $8.5 million. But here's the kicker, it wasn't just a record for the show. It was a record for the industry. Parker Schnabel was officially a legend, and season 9 was just the beginning. But wait, there's more. Each season after, Parker didn't just rest on his laurels. Oh no. He kept pushing, kept innovating, and kept smashing records. From mechanical mishaps to global pandemics, Parker and his team faced obstacle after obstacle. And yet, with every season, they kept raising the bar. Fast forward to season 12, and what do we see? A jaw-dropping 8,397 ounces of gold. That's over $10 million in gold. The man is relentless, and it's not just the gold that's impressive. It's the sheer will to keep going, keep improving, and keep innovating. One of Parker's boldest moves came after his lease with Tony Beats expired. Instead of playing it safe, Parker put it all on the line, dropping a whopping $15 million to acquire Dominion Creek, a site rumored to hold up to 80,000 ounces of gold. Can you imagine the guts it takes to make a decision like that? To bet everything on a patch of land? But that's what separates the great from the good. Dominion Creek wasn't just about striking it rich. It was about changing the game. The land presented unique challenges, deep gold deposits, expensive equipment, and significant financial risks. But Parker, always one to embrace the challenge, dove in headfirst. And by early 2024, they had already pulled 4,000 ounces from the site. That's just the beginning. If this gamble pays off, and all signs point to yes, it could cement Parker's legacy as one of the greatest miners in history. But let's not forget, none of this happens without a solid team. Rick Ness, Chris Domit, Mitch Blaschke, Brennan Rualt, and the newest addition, Tyson Lee, these guys aren't just part of Parker's crew, they're his backbone. Whether it's fixing machinery, leading operations, or just getting their hands dirty, they're the unsung heroes of every gold rush triumph. So, what can we learn from Parker's journey? It's not just about chasing gold, it's about chasing dreams. It's about understanding that success doesn't come easy, that every ounce of gold is earned through blood, sweat, and sometimes tears. Parker's story isn't just one of financial success, it's about resilience, innovation, and leadership. Whether it's the depth of the minds or the depth of his strategy, Parker digs deeper than anyone else. And what's next for Parker Schnabel? Well, if his track record is anything to go by, it's going to be something spectacular. New ventures, bigger risks, 
and even greater rewards. But before you go, let me leave you with this thought. What would you do if you had the courage to bet it all? If you had Parker Schnabel's drive to push beyond your limits, how much could you accomplish? Stay tuned, because this gold rush story is far from over.